But somebody else who's all about controversy, her whole career, now she's trying to push it away, it's Paris Hilton. Because Paris Hilton's in the news again, everybody. And she's in the news because... Again? Uh, you mean uh, from 1994 to now? Well, Thank I you. mean, she's been in the news a million times. But she's <laughs> news, you know? But, you know, A24, A24, Sabrina, is doing a bio series about Paris Hilton, which I'm like... Does she warn A24? I mean, A24 no. is great production. They're doing so much stuff right now, but do they, is it going to be like like graphic and she going to be killing bitches? I mean, I don't know, like slaughtering bitches for taking her camera and her Instagram posts? I, I don't know. But this is moving forward May 24. It's based off her memoir that came out titled Paris, the Memoir riveting but that came <laughs> you know riveting but the details in the plot are currently under wraps but she will be the executive producer on this of project of course she will and she'll have a lot of influence in there she said that this whole thing it's really she said i wrote the book so that it could show the world who i am today and she's talked about how she lost her power before and then she got it back with her family and her friends getting behind her and having kids and that really empowered her to change her and and this is a whole different paris hilton before and she's talking about the effort that she went through during a time when we didn't have social media the way it is. People weren't influencers back then, but she was in a lot of ways an influencer. So the idea is to showcase the early pivotal times in social media before it blew up where Paris Hilton conquered the world. And, you know, and she was kind of, you know, talk bad about it. Look at, that, look at the South Park episode. I mean, I laugh my ass off at that South Park episode. Where's my dog? It's, 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 it's fucking great. Her and that little dog, everyone knows about those fucking things. It's like a meme in the making right there. So there's probably a million memes out there. But Paris Selling is a bio series is moving forward. Not much details, but it is happening. Brandon, what do you think? You want to see Paris Selling that I've been a bio series? What do you think about this? I mean, if anyone uh, could literally uh, say that uh, as an answer to who owned an entire decade, it would be Paris Hilton. Like, she is such a phenomenal like person. Like growing up in uh, the South Park episode, you really got it. Like it. As you saw her Still everywhere. Great. Like you, That's could, you turn left, and then you saw like something of Paris Hilton's, and, and it just yeah. I mean, I would love to see like that where where the internalness of that kind of kind of fame would uh, would uh, affect a person, and so on and so forth. So, I mean, you know, just getting a little uh, window into the person that like literally did so much and was like the face of a decade was yeah, pretty pretty interesting stuff. Yeah. Um, you know, I, it is interesting, but I'm also like, hasn't she done enough? Can we just like push her aside, Goldie? Like, second, do we have to second. see more Paris Hilton again? Like, come on, Goldie. She's first, She's first been irrelevant all, for a long fucking time. First of all, she should play MLK. That's the way I see it. <laughs> <laughs> I hate you so much. What the fuck? Paris Hilton is famous for being famous. That's it. Who, fuck, who cares? It's insane why anyone would put money, time, energy, or even any creative droplet of spirit into trying to do anything else for this young lady who has it all. I just don't understand. I understand why America gives a shit because they work at the family dollar and they eat fucking red vines for dinner and they want to see her fucking life. But I mean, <laughs> Jesus Christ, we're in the entertainment industry and that's cool. That's one little segment. But what about like we just get back to making some fucking movies? And some art with some movies. Yes, some movies, people. I mean, it's it's, 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 it's it's honestly as probably the oldest person on the internet. I have to say, this is offensive. <laughs> I I you, feel you, Goldie. No, I mean, I, I feel you, though, because honestly, it's like, why? I mean, we don't really. I mean, the question we always say on the show, do we need this? And no. I mean, it is. Oh, but, no, we don't. We, no, wait. <laughs> No. Oh, no, no, <laughs> or what the uh, repo, the genetic opera. I remember repo, the genetic opera. I actually kind of like that. That was kind of hilarious. So I don't know if you ever saw that goal. That's a, that was a fun project. And had the guy from a bucket of vampires. Like, yeah, it was oh, fun. It was, I, I, yeah, yeah, you know, <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Sabrina. <laughs> I know you're blowing away, Goldie. Blowing away. I just, uh, <laughs> you know, what people do with their time is pretty incredible. We have We're a request. We have we a request. Mm. Oh, what's happening? Sabrina, 
You're welcome, Ryan. Sabrina, what do you think about Paris Hilton drink. doing this? Do you think that this is a good idea as no. a bio series? Will it make no. money? But it's no. A24. Do you think people no. will go see it just based on no. the fact that A24 no. is creating this project? No. Yeah, I don't really think so. No, yeah. people will go see it. Not because it's A24. People who just are obsessed with, you know, fame. Like, people who watch the Kardashians will go see it. Like, I don't, you know what I mean? Like, that's just not my thing. Uh, I, I, I worked on House of Wax, by the way. Queen Glamazona, my girl. Um, and she was a cunt. She fucking did not come to set on time. We were out in the cold, freezing her asses off in no clothes for like a very, very long time. And she just was in her trailer doing who knows what. Doing this. Um, you know, she was probably saying that's hot and snorting cocaine off someone's penis. I don't really give a fuck, but I just, like, she was well, a horrible, horrible person. <laughs> Um, so I, I know, I think I don't, I'm not saying that she's that same person, but she was super annoying and super disrespectful to an entire crew of people who were there to shoot her in a movie. Uh, and actually she wound up never showing up and they sent everyone home. So thanks for that. Don't you love when um, that happens? I'm a, I'm a hard pass on this, like an extreme hard pass, not just a regular oh, okay. hard pass. Like a kindly go fuck yourself. Don't ever fucking do this hard pass. I'm sorry. I'm what so, I I've, I've had... I don't I know. drive past the theater with you, Sabrina, with picket signs. And we go in front of A24. <laughs> you know what fucking assholes they are for doing that. I just, I'm like, you're A24. Like, what are you reducing yourself to? I don't know. I just don't understand. Like, I, you know, I don't know. That South Park episode was amazing. That's, the, the, the most enjoyment I've had out of Paris Hilton's existence was that South Park episode. So, mm. based that's on where A24's I'm. success, I think the Paris Hilton movie should be called Absolutely Nothing in All Places All at the Same Time. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Uh, with Hit the, that with goalie. The, with the, Catch it. With a dot, dot, dot. My parents are super fucking rich, and that's the only reason why I'm famous. Yeah, there instead you go. of the, the hot dog fingers, she's had dick fingers. I'll watch that. <laughs> she's like plunging him in any crevice she can find. Any crevice she can find. Damn. Unbelievable. <laughs> she Paris, might fuck hey, you, Paris. Goldie, with those fingers. Paris, good luck to you. I'm so sorry for all the hard times. <laughs> <laughs>